A lot of businesses are trying to work around our recent wet weather. New at 6, Fox 2 meteorologist Haley Fitzpatrick spoke with a local lawn care company that took advantage of today's dry weather to catch up. Saturated soils and wet grass, all thanks to the recent rain that we've had over the last several weeks. This is affecting a lot of people region wide, like local farmers, but also lawn care businesses as they work around dealing with the wet weather. The amount of rain that we've had, it's been a nightmare. I mean, we've seen, you know, growth like I haven't seen this much growth in this this time of year in a long time. Businesses like Caps Green Lawn in Maryland Heights takes advantage of dry time like today in order to get caught up in work around the bi-state region. The biggest problem we've had in the last couple uh, of weeks, obviously just getting out and doing our work. Um, I think just for people that are homeowners alone are having a hard time even just mowing. Uh, doing simple things like getting out in the yard. You'll see a lot of yards that we're getting out to and people are mowing half their yard because the back has been sitting underwater for two weeks. The ground being so soft creates its own problems. It's nice to see the sun today and finally get out and do something. They mentioned that cutting your yard after a period of rain before the soils have had time to soak up the water will damage the blades of your grass. Usually this does recover by itself, but bigger problems begin to emerge by mowing your grass when it's wet. An uptick in fungus right now. Uh, that's another thing too where, you know, a homeowner cuts too much off, the grass blade gets damaged and then, you know, fungus starts to take over. Questions or concerns you have about your yard? If you're in doubt, just call and ask somebody. You know, obviously we're up here, there's other lawn companies out there too, but, um, you know, their mother nature does a lot of funny things. It's just been really tough. So, but luckily, like I said, today was a nice day and um, we're finally getting some work done. Reporting in Maryland Heights, I'm meteorologist Haley Fitzpatrick, Fox 2 News.